the old technologies exist but what is the new change that i'm trying to bring i am here to make a change in the agrotech industries so i don't understand hydroponics okay that's quite expensive no because i can buy a potato for 10 bucks it doesn't make any sense right now 27% is not the right number 27% might be the right number in terms of number of farmers who have thought about it exploring this kind of arena where i am able to pitch in front of a vc it is a very great opportunity i'll get to know uh, their feedback their suggestions about the startup idea that i am presenting so i think it will be a great success for me hi pratik hello i'm doing very well Firstly thank you so much for this golden opportunity to it will be a great experience for me to take your valuable insights on the project I'll present in front of you all you are uh, making a change in the edtech industry i am here to make a change in the agrotech industry sir my name is soham goel and i am doing btech over here i am a tech enthusiast apart from that i have a keen interest in agrotech industry and today my project is based on that name of my project is automatic hydroponic systems hydroponic system is a technology in which water is used efficiently to grow up plant or any kind of crop but what i have realized is there is no automation in that the problem statement is the old technologies exist but what is the new change that i am trying to bring so the solution is that i have created a very unique embedded device that you can connect with the crops in a certain way that it reduces the space efficiency it more convenient for a farmer or a cultivator to grow crops and it is a way of urban farming how you are able to grow efficiently and smartly you are reducing the time you are reducing the labor cost you are reducing the overall cost of growing plant and making more profits sir. apart from that there is a resource optimization how uh, like the water flow if i specifically talk about a uh, huge amount of water is wasted on a regular basis now the calibrators or the sensors that i have used in my device they are so powerful and they are so efficient that i can very systematically only use particular amount of water how much water is required in states like rajasthan haryana some specific parts of uttar pradesh and jharkhand and bihar we have a severe water issues sir i think farmers die to have a clear uh, supply of water and in that areas i think our product will have a great boom because i'm reducing the cost i'm reducing the water supply a minimum water supply requirement is fulfilled and crop or the plant is grown in its full efficiency so i am including three new technologies in my product the first technology is a nutrient film technique in which additional nutrients are priorly added in a system so that additional chemical fertilizers are not required what we call organic khana hai इनऑर्गेनिक नहीं क्यों आज के टाइम पे सब्जियां छाटनी पड़ती हैं क्यों बस ऐसे ही डालने और डायरेक्टली घर पे ले जाएं वो कैसे हम इंप्रूव करें तो उसके लिए न्यूट्रिएंट फिल्म टेक्नोलॉजी एग्जिस्ट करती है आफ्टर डैट अ डीप वाटर कल्टीवेशन वाटर का सप्लाई एग्जैक्टली जा ही नहीं पाता रूट्स तक उसको इंप्रूव करेंगे ड्रिप इरीगेशन से जो कि हमारे एम्बेडेड सिस्टम से कनेक्ट रहेगा आफ्टर डैट वी हैव एरोपोनिक्स डैट ऑब्वियसली वी आर यूजिंग सर एंड दिस इज अ वेरी बेस मॉडल ऑफ हाउ एन एरोपोनिक सिस्टम इज कनेक्टेड विद एन एम्बेड डिवाइस आफ्टर डैट वॉट अ मेजर यू की मैंने अपना पर्सनल इनपुट किया दिया आई हैव एडेड यू एस ए आर टी डैट इज यूनिवर्सल सिंक्रोनाइज ए सिंक्रोनाइज रिवर्स universal transmitted systems so in that there is an pre existing technology that can manually handle all the process of a plant kya aap pehle to seed ugayenge aap uske baad aap puri growth monitor karenge manually plants ko water denge proper growth dekhenge kide na lag jaye wo na lag jaye sab hamara embedded device karega so overall aapko plant ugana you have to just keep a basic eye check you are reducing the labor cost and it is very easy for you to grow anything sir ye to samajh aa gaya ki ha automation bahut acha hai but ek traditional automation और एक ट्रेडिशनल हाइड्रोपोनिक्स और एक ऑटोमेशन हाइड्रोपोनिक्स में क्या डिफरेंस होता है ट्रेडिशनल हाइड्रोपोनिक्स बहुत मैनुअल होता है इसके अंदर कोई भी नई टेक्नोलॉजी अभी तक नहीं आई है व्हाट वी हैव ऑटोमेटेड इज द सेंसर्स द टीडीएस कंट्रोलर्स द पीएच कंट्रोलर एंड द पीएच कैलिब्रेटर जो कि मैंने खुद डिजाइन करा है तो आई थिंक रोबोटिक्स का बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट प्लेयर है इसमें सर आफ्टर दैट डिपेंडेंस ऑन मैनुअल एफर्ट मैंने बहुत कम करा है इससे आपकी ओवरऑल कॉस्ट तो रिड्यूस होगी ही और साथ ही साथ प्लांट स्ट्रेस और एक ह्यूमन स्ट्रेस कम होगा सो दैट यू कैन इजिली ग्रो plants and you are less stressed about the overall growth sir after that i have used growing trays 
पंप्स एंड ओवरऑल लाइटनिंग सर दिस इज द एग्जैक्ट सेटअप वॉट मैनुअली इवन आई हैव डन मैंने जोर तोड़ के जो अपने आप बेस्ट में बना पाया सो दिस इज द बेस डेट आई हैव क्रिएटेड एंड इट इज अ प्रॉपर एम्बेडेड सिस्टम जिसको मैंने टारगेट किया था आफ्टर डैट एक डिवाइस बिल्ड है ना कि मेरा डिवाइस वर्क कैसे करता है सो वी आर इनिशियलाइजिंग ऑल द सेंसर्स आफ्टर डैट अ प्रॉपर वॉटर फ्लो इज चेक डिन कि कितना अमाउंट पे वो जा रहा है कितने पे नहीं जा रहा है आफ्टर डैट द पी एच आर रेडी दे एक्टिवेट द पी एच एंड दे आर चेकिंग की क्या उसमें वाटर फ्लो करेक्ट है नहीं है एंड हाउ एफिशियंटली अ प्लांट इज ग्रोइंग कस्टमर सेटिस्फाइड द फार्मर इज सेटिस्फाइड एंड ओवरऑल द प्रोडक्ट इज गुड सर सो जस्ट आई वॉन्ट टू शो अबाउट द फ्यूचर स्कोप ऑफ हाइड्रोपोनिक सर द वेरी फर्स्ट थिंग इज हाइड्रोपोनिक सिस्टम हैज अ डायरेक्ट सेल बाय टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी सेवन वी आर एक्सपेक्टिंग दैट फोर्टी परसेंट ऑफ द वर्ल्ड क्रॉप्स एंड प्लांट्स एंड वेजिटेबल्स विल बी सोलमली ग्रोन ऑन द टेक्नोलॉजी ऑफ हाइड्रोपोनिक्स सो इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू ब्रिंग अ मैनुअल चेंज अ ऑटोमेटिक चेंज आई थिंक दैट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट आफ्टर दैट प्लांट एंड फूड सिक्योरिटी इज अ मेजर कंसर्न डिजीजेज भी जाएंगे प्लांट बेटर ग्रो होगा आप पे चॉइस बेटर होगी एज अ फार्मर आप पे रेट्स ज्यादा होंगे वी कैन डायरेक्टली ऑल्सो कनेक्ट विद ब्लिंकेट वी कैन कनेक्ट विद न्यूट्री फ्रेश एमेजॉन फ्रेश और बहुत सारी कंपनीज के साथ आप डायरेक्टली कोलेबरेट कर सकते हो विद बी टू बी और विद क्यू एस आर और एफ एफ और फास्ट फूड चेन सो डैट दे कैन डायरेक्टली टेक अप प्रोडक्ट्स सो एक रिलायबिलिटी बनेगी एक ट्रस्ट बनेगा एंड एट द एंड प्रोडक्ट बहुत अच्छे निकल के आएगा सो डैट्स इट सर आई वुड लाइक टू कंक्लूड माई स्पीच एंड आई वुड लाइक टू टेक यू वैल्यूबल फीडबैक सो योर कस्टमर इज योर फार्मर और कस्टमर इज कंज्यूमर्स लाइक एज हु आर बाइंग वेजिटेबल्स फ्रॉम डायरेक्ट Uh, I think so I have decided to take it into two revenue models. First is we can either sell the embedded system directly. Second is we can take uh, like agricultural lands on lease and we can create our own hydroponic systems and we can connect with the Blinket or any like black source companies that can directly sell it to customers. Right now we are not targeting D2C. What we are targeting is business to business like we are selling to other companies. Would you create your own infrastructure, or would you just sell to farmers who are already looking for hydroponic systems? Ah, uh, to the farmers who are already looking for. Uh, have you talked to farmers? Yes, sir. they have asked for it. Yes, sir. Like they were very keen. They were like very happy to know that we have stress load come over. हमारी जो एफिशिएंसी है वो बढ़ रही है और एक प्लांट जो कि छः महीने लगाता है उसको साढ़े पाँच या पाँच महीने में मैं उगा पा रहा हूँ विद बेटर ग्रोथ विद बेटर न्यूट्रिशनल वैल्यू दीज आर फार्मर्स हु आर ऑलरेडी यूजिंग सम हाइड्रोपोनिक सिस्टम यस सर हाउ मनी फार्मर्स यूज हाइड्रोपोनिक सिस्टम टूडे लाइक वॉट इज द वॉट इज साइज ऑफ दैट मार्केट टूडे सो द साइज ऑफ दैट मार्केट ग्लोबली आई वुड से इज अराउंड Like 40 But India, how many farmers are using hydroponic? Sir, as of now, as per the statistics, only 27% are using out of 100% stat. And I don't have exact figures, but in a percentage, that's very accurate, sir. And specifically, seasonal crops and major cultivating crops like wheat and rice is a major market. So plants are shifting from a traditional. Uh, the farmers are shifting from a traditional way to the hydroponic. So this is one thing I would like for you to verify. Twenty-seven percent is not the right number. All right. In terms of output, twenty-seven percent might be the right number in terms of number of farmers who have. Thought about it. Thought or maybe tried. Maybe tried it. Specific. But but truly okay. output wise, twenty seven percent cannot be the right number. So the question is that are farmers really activated today that they are thinking about it? If no, then you have to create that market. Now assuming farmers have been activated and farmers know that they are looking for it, what is the process for them? They will search for it. That what are the, what are the other hydroponic systems? When that happens, how do they compare? Talk to your customer to appreciate this better. that what is their decision making process so today the way you have presented it it's it's great and i'm sure you have thought about it deeply what is your differentiation and what is your why is your product special but just taking it from a farmer's perspective that what is his decision making process so that needs to be double click don customer first articulation is missing and uh, that will lead to pricing discussion that will lead to moats discussion and i'm sure there are answers but worth double clicking on customer aspect better by just first defining who the customer is i definitely look into this thank you so i don't understand hydroponics so can i buy this device and in my home grow potato yes sir i can do that definitely so what is the net cost of owning a thing that makes me one put that let's say grows one potato or per whatever the cycle of a potato uh, is let us assume the cycle is for around 5 or 6 months so i think you need my embedded device a plant based system you can grow in anywhere you can connect my embedded device to the water flow system cost care total system ka cost care total system ke sir abhi jo mereko prototype banane mein laga it costed me 6700 and if i reduce the cost agar so to grow one potato over 6 months i have to spend 6700 rupees all ready up for one potato as of now okay that's quite expensive no because i can buy a potato for 10 bucks 
hundred percent. But by the time you are growing it, you will have a better consumability and you will have a very fresh product. As of now, what I have personally. No, consumer के लिए cost sense नहीं बनता. Like it doesn't make any sense right now. Unless you're saying that I can grow twenty potatoes or thirty potatoes or grow much more. Consumer wise, like I'm just learning from yes, you, yes, right? Yes. I don't think the consumer hydroponics makes sense then commercially. Uh, I think sir, अगर consumer पे अगर मैं जाना होगा तो उनको directly fruits or vegetables supply कर सकते हैं. Haan. Embedded system हो. Hey, but farmers के लिए भी six thousand seven hundred rupees for one potato I don't think makes sense. But I don't think they'll go. Uh, they'll grow just one potato. No, you're, you're saying that square foot wise for one potato it costs six thousand. That's my assumption. Uh, like if you're growing at your home, let us take an example. No, I'm so, saying farmer, farmer के लिए. फार्मर के लिए तो सर कॉस्ट और एफिशिएंट हो जाएगी क्योंकि अगर उनपे ऑलरेडी एक हाइड्रोपॉनिक एग्जिस्ट करता है तो फॉर देम इट विल इक्वलाइज टू अराउंड 35 मिनट्स सो आई नो नो आई थिंक आई थिंक व्हाट द आंसर यू आर लुकिंग फॉर is typically products created by hydroponic systems are 30 to 40% more expensive than what we get in the market got it so it's expensive but it's not crazily expensive got it so got it's better now i'm just finding a relative versus uh, 30, regular 30 to 40% more expensive okay so then you are it's a waiting game till it becomes cheaper and there'll be a timing to do this business which it's probably not today and but i have a cool idea as a consumer because i don't understand this space at all so okay. everything i say please take it with a grain of salt but i think as a consumer it it might be a cool idea to go to wealthy people put led lights on the hydroponics and sell it to them as a consumer product where you can grow stuff at home and like take care of it like a fish tank cool product that people can have at home and show off to their friends they go for a product i'm think growing a, a potato gimmicky product rather than actual yeah, product yeah it's a gimmick I... it's a gimmick it's but, a toy yeah, but, but then but it, it, it can... farmer ke point of view se liye i think unke liye to kafi efficient ho jayega kyunki yeah. unka labor or sub cost correct so. but because i don't understand the farming ecosystem i can only look at it as a consumer so yeah, i'm only consumer. giving you feedback as a consumer yes. ki this is the only thing i could find valuable that is a cool toy at home like a yeah. furniture piece of furniture But I think from a farmer thing, relative to this thing, as soon as the cost makes sense, maybe. But Pratik will know a lot more because he probably sees more startups like this. But sir, that's a I've very lucrative zero. idea, and definitely look into it. If you can create a very small system or a very small embedded device, if they want to grow something out of their home, like. If they're interested to grow even chilies or like just a normal plant of flowers, tell their friends. They go my chili. I'm growing chili. Look at me. A lot of people do that. A lot of people have disposable income and they just want to show their friends. They go, I have this thing at home. Yeah. Maybe there's a tiny market there. I don't know if it's a big market, but but I'll definitely look into it. Sir. Cool. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you. I was expecting very constructive feedbacks, but it was such a friendly conversation with both of them. They told me how I can uplift this, how I can create a superb revenue model. A revenue model is very important when you are pitching or when you are aiming for a good startup. So I think overall it was a very valuable experience for me. Anj. I think uh, the most valuable and most positive feedback that I have received in today's pitch was to make a plan on how will farmers be benefited from it. Okay. Secondly, how customers will be attracted towards the product. that i am presenting and third that i should have a strong revenue model out of that